Okay friends, it's time to get started on replacing our PCV valve. One of the first things we have to do, of course, is to locate it. If you look along the driver's side valve cover of your truck, you'll be able to find the PCV valve right there, and then of course the hose that leads up along here. Ours is broken, so I'll show you how to get it out of here. One of the first things we're going to do is pop off this clip right here. That's just holding this line to the other. Pop that off and out of the way. Now we can come down to the valve cover where the PCV valve is. I'm just going to use a rag, clean around the general area just to help keep the dirt and debris away from falling into the engine. After that, go ahead and grab onto it, give it a nice little wiggle, and draw it out of the valve cover. The next thing you'd want to do is come over to this side, lift this up and off of here, and then remove it from the truck. Like I said, ours is broken, so I'm just going to cut off the existing piece on there, and then we'll get ready for our install. Okay, now it's time to get ready for the install here, so let's go ahead and slide it in. I'm going to put it underneath this other line. I'll slide it on right up here. Should be nice and pressed fit on there. You definitely don't want that coming loose. And then right down here into the valve cover. Slide that down and just ensure that it's not loose. It should lift up if you give it a light tug, but it shouldn't just flop around without any pressure. After that, you just want to go ahead and put your latch on here. That'll hold those two lines together. Okay, so now all you have to do is go ahead and start up the truck, make sure you don't have any check engine light, and then take it for a road test.